Turning now to some other stories we are following this morning in surrounding counties. Jury deliberations continue this morning in the trial for the murder of a sheriff's deputy in Hall County. The teenage suspect at the center of the case now admitting to pulling the trigger, getting emotional on the stand. I take week. responsibility for it, yeah. I mean, I did the sin. I got to confess it to sin. Are you admitting to this jury that you took Deputy Dixon's life? Yeah, I, I, like I said, you got to confess to your sins. I... Hector Garcia Solis was 17 years old at the time. Although he says he doesn't remember a lot about that night in 2019, he says he was the one who shot Deputy Nicholas Blaine Dixon during a chase in Gainesville. London Alexander Clements and Eric Eduardo Velasquez were also with Garcia Solis. At the time, the deputy tried to stop the stolen vehicle they were in. Both of them are also standing trial. We have new details about a Gainesville firefighter, Chandler Patterson's funeral. He's going to be laid to rest tomorrow in Rayburn County. Patterson's family says a celebration of life will be held at 2 p.m. at Rayburn County High School where he attended. The procession will be from the high school to Betty's Creek Baptist Church in Dillard. Patterson died on Sunday, a day after having a boating accident on Lake Tugelo. For more information on the funeral plans, visit 11alive.com. And today, Georgia's Supreme Court swears in a new Chief of Justice. He's David E. Namias. He served on the state Supreme Court since his appointment by Governor Purdue in 2009. Namias has won several statewide elections. Michael P. Boggs will be sworn in as the new presiding justice. Boggs has served on the high court since his appointment started in 2016. The ceremony is happening this afternoon at the state capitol.